remove Sweden. There should just be one province of one base tax and subsistence agriculture. I'd call them a wasteland, but uh, that would be an insult to the central Sahara. Kill them. One, two, three. So you'll slaughter them and then I want you to turn around because there are other Portuguese provinces to take care of. Shunats, couldn't care less. Go away. And we have a good number of troops here with transports to take care of these colonies. Thank God there are a lot of colonies. Whimper. Eight of them? Is eight really enough? Should be done quick enough anyway. No! Not as planned. Okay, I see how you want to play this. Three stacks and four stacks. So, in Art of War, when you want your troops to move overseas, you can tell them just to move and the game will automatically sort out transportation for you. Gotta say, I'm kinda looking forward to that. Well, we've got nine navies, that should be plenty. One of them needs to be a four, though. So we tell all of you to get on the ships except for the four stack and then all our threes move out leaving the four the four gets on a ship we send out the four and then we tell you guys where to go a one that's, that's mine a two a three a four Do I deal with Shitatsu Show's Holiday Home Extravaganza After Party? You know what? I dare say we will. Fort Level 3, Fort Level 1, Fort Level 1. Two of you can take care of that. The other two can get yourselves over here. Gonna be one too many. No problem. Oh, yeah. Jake, Sunda, Terminate, Andamans. Ah. Correct, Amundo. Good, Algiers has been removed. I could annex them right now. But that would be quite the overextension that I don't want right now. That's another problem removed. Ah, all these problems just melting away. Melting like the wizards from Majesty. Anything else I really have to worry about in this area? 
liking how Newfoundland isn't winning this battle. I wonder why not. Well, it is of little concern to me. I'll deal with them in my own time. <sighs> okay, Portugal. Once I tie up this and this, do you have any other tricks up your sleeves for me? Always more islands to be sieging out here. Oh wow, it did get beaten on the Shetlands. Which tells me I need somewhat more men. I'm able to pick up 18 here. I wonder what will happen to those if I just move my fleet away. Probably a very cruel thing to try to figure out. But we'll do it anyway. We'll get 9,000 troops on the case. We will give them decent leadership. Yeah, instantly dead. Too bad. Hope that didn't flip show superiority in Sweden's favour. So the knights still remaining defender of the Catholic faith, are you? I do honestly wonder what I'm going to do about that. I mean, if I uh, fight the knights, every other independent nation is going to join the coalition against me. way to circumvent it. I could declare war on Algiers to bring in Portugal, but there's no guaranteeing Portugal would ally uh, honour the call to arms, especially since both of them would be wrecked so hard. I could fight the knights in a separate war and just peace out, but I wonder if doing that would instantly lose me all my vassals because it would re-protectorate me. Or would it unprotect? Oh, who even knows? Alternatively, I could keep a war going with everyone who's going to be fighting against me so that they can't coalition me. I mean, thinking about it, who would coalition me? Well, Sweden's going to get annexed. Great Britain would. Portugal would already be in the second war with me. There are no Native Americans that care deeply enough about me. Punjab and Delhi have forgiven me. You know, I don't think that coalition would be too bad. The Knights can join in all they want. Bane tells me to permanently stay in war till the end of the game with the knights. Who am I to doubt the great words of Bane? The words of Bane the Great. Hmm. 
do 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 another one bites dust. These are taking a bit long. Fleets are taking a while to get in position as well. Or maybe it's just that I'm going so painfully slowly. 1803. Uh, sorry, 1805. Didn't I start this in 1803? So I suppose that's not bad considering it's only been two wars since two years since this war started. Still every year is incredibly precious. Don't wanna lose. One problem is that I do really want this province to be mine since it's the march, but it's probably quite expensive to take. There's going to be a lot of provinces I want to take. Hmm. Wow, France converted a province? They're actually converting a few. Thanks to cathedrals. Okay, good to know. Germany looking pretty much written off as animist. Check the bigger picture. Animism very nearly the, uh, the dominant religion in the world. God, that fills me with such joy. another annoying little province to deal with. <sighs> Algiers unsurprisingly begging for peace. Oh, I'll give them peace. Peace to Hitler's ass! Don't know what you're sitting around there doing nothing for. Is there anyone you can pick up? Yes. I own those? I don't remember taking those. Oh no, that was very late on. Very, very late on. It's all coming back to me now. shouldn't be forgetting about Zanzibar itself. I mean, who could ever really forget about the hardest mission on Railroad Tycoon? Or was it Sid Meier's Railroads? So that's what we'll do. Once you eliminate these Portuguese, there, detach enough to keep that siege going, and the rest of you march on the Zanzibar, pretty please. Oh, he's got a blockade. <sighs> Can't underestimate this guy. 
Must be a bit of underestimating. Wouldn't it be a bit foolish to march straight in there with uh, mostly cannon? Onwards. Gee. Set up to attack Great Britain in a separate war before going back to war with Portugal, Jake. The power and the power imbalance should mean the knights don't get involved. You can keep fighting knights and Portugal while you finish off Great Britain, Dao, Delhi, and Punjab before Portugal in the Second War as well. Why? They won't join in the coalition. I can't forget about this province here. But I seem to be forgetting about it. Another case of it's all one island. Okay. Okay, I see. The twentieth fleet has the sixty first army, which is not moving. So I can safely move you elsewhere. Like here. Because that needs to be taken. Crushed under this micromanagement. And Marvin's right, if I become a protectorate again, I lose all my vassals. And that is game over. I should really declare war on Sui while the going's good. Mm, nah, perhaps not. I can't Alex kill while then if he's going to be blocking off this strait. Especially if I don't have the ships to stop him. So I can't worry about that. Sweden is almost annex, although I still need to make my move on Shetland. Folks fought well. Maybe, just maybe, I'll go and get you. Alright, welcome to the fold. Uh, game? There we go. Goes straight to Castilian Mexico, who probably can't core the land, but it gives me. A little base to put my trips in, which is nice. Porto down, but still not uh, Braganza. Yeah, I do like the little new exploits message that you get. I think it's quite cute. Do I have ships with spare men on them? That's a three. That is not. There we go. Again, if I can get all these fiddly little islands, as well as his march, before I declare war on him for a second go. I 
I need to make sure I annex Algiers in this war as well. Hmm. Kilwa. You may laugh for now, but I'll make sure I get the last laugh. Dashing Portugal's ability to field a navy could well be vital for me as well. Right. Let's hope 9,000 well led men are enough. Pshaw. Lose that power, see what I care. Jake, I came in late. Is Rome animist yet? Well, you will be surprised to learn that it is not. However, most of Germany is. And even France is starting to convert. We will get animism as the uh, most widely practiced religion in the world. Or die trying. Yeah, you're marching on to there. Okay, do they have anything further east than that? Or does that mean I have all of their colonies under siege? All of their fiddly little islands? Okay, looks promising. It's so easy to miss some of these. So easy. Jake Andaman. Huh, yeah. The Andamans. How about that? What level of fort are you? Just level one. Well, we'll give you a, a special treatment. Of course, it's not just the Andamans, is it? There's a. Uh, there we go, Saint Helena. Yeah, I can deal with you later. God, but there's no time. It's 1806. Less than 15 years to go. Uh. sure I take all these Portuguese lands. Leave them with nothing. That'll be all these lands as well and whatever I can pick out from Asia. I just hope it's enough. What isn't good is this. If Sweden occupy any land, then I can't annex them. So you're only fort level two. We should leave you with uh, two and not a man more. The rest of you get back onto that ship. We're going to kill some Swedish what we do best. Chocolate Island down. 
Jake, Fernando Poe. I've got Fernando Poe. Don't you worry, girly. Jake, St. Helena. I already pointed out St. Helena. But that will probably be something for the Second War. After all, picking off all these islands is probably going to chew up the uh, war score enough as it is. I wonder if I could get my fleet down there. It will be somewhat necessary. Folks, head over to Fife. We'll engage with the Swedes there. Shouldn't I have more transports kicking about? Three there, 18 there. 53 here, huh? Got a small detachment down there to deal with you folks. Not for this war, but the next one. Yeah, there's a few fiddly islands, but I'll get them in the second war, I think. Okay, right, seems that uh, Newfoundland's getting whipped. Ah, oh, great, the march fell. And the march is going to cost... Hmm. Only 6%. Don't know where they get off, assuming that it's so expensive to take all of their land. Must just be the sheer number of colonies. Oh, now that's not kosher. Still, you'll be a uh, club man level of tech, aren't you? South African muskets. Pathetic uh, tactics. I have a feeling you're going to fall. Pshaw. You are no match for glorious Ryukyu and discipline. You rack. Discipline. When you praise the golden trotters like this, it's no problem. Whoa, okay. Didn't desire this at all. ships there. More than a couple. Somebody was suggesting that Aland or Holland or whatever you call it or pronounce it might be in a bit of dire straits. No such situation. Frankly, I don't fancy my chances here until we get a few more troops back. Yeah, these are all f falling, which is great news for us. That isn't. Didn't I send a fairly sizable army that way? Okay. You win this time, Kilwa, but I'll be taking most of your land. Yeah, as I recall, that was quite a big stack of troops I sent that way. Most unfortunate. Okay. Don't think I even have that much to worry about around here. 